There are a lot of technical challenges with getting so much poop from point A to point B, and the fact that we do it mostly out of mind, I think, is cause for celebration. YouTube, YouTube, what is going on? I'm your host, Runaway Child, and I'm back at y'all with another one. If you haven't hit that subscribe button, take the opportunity right now. Go ahead, hit that subscribe button. And if you're already subscribed to the channel, hey, throw a like on this video. A like don't cost you anything to throw on this video. It is for free, so please show your boy some love. But anyhow, what I got for y'all today is, first off, let me say Merry Christmas to all of those who had a blessed Christmas, who went out and did their thing, took care of their kids. And I also want to say thank you to the new subscribers. I also want to say thank you to the ones who have been viewing the channel and helping for the views and the interaction to go up. Thank you, thank you, thank you. I can't thank you enough. But what I got for y'all today is, I don't know if y'all heard, California is adopting a new law. They're trying to turn your sewage water into drinking water. So you're going to have a poo-poo, boo-boo, doo-doo, you-hoo. That's what you're going to be drinking. They are approving the regulations that will govern uh, direct potable reuse, meaning treating this water to a standard where it can be either served directly to customers or go to a drinking water treatment plant. We have a wastewater treatment facility first that makes it very clean, and then we have additional processes to make it to drinking water standards. So there's a whole um, technology in between the toilet and the tap. Now, I'm not sure if y'all heard that correctly, but let me break it down for the ones who didn't understand it. Y'all fixing to be drinking boo-boo water. I don't know what these folks is thinking of. I don't know the entire process of what goes into it or how does it work, but to me, it just sounds disgusting. Like, ah! Who wants to drink sewage water? I don't care if you purified it a thousand times. I don't want to drink no sewage water. Who does that? But these people, they are making decisions and they're putting y'all in situations to where y'all gonna be walking around with the boo-boo breath. So, y'all let me know what y'all think. Y'all wanna be drinking boo-boo water? I don't know. d -cell's one part. Stormwater capture, wastewater capture, one water. Being more abundant in our mindset. There's plenty of water that flows through that just flows right out that we can reuse that is high quality, safe, and affordable. Sewers need to be designed not just for the present conditions, but also for the growth and changes to the city over time. More people usually means more wastewater, and sewers must be sized accordingly. I mean, we live in California where the drought uh, happens all the time, and with climate change, it will only get worse. And this is a drought-resistant supply that we will need um, in the future to meet the demands of our communities. And so that's why we opened this facility. Yeah, so there is a, a very extensive um, advanced water treatment process, and it uh, goes through three stages. So microfiltration, reverse osmosis, and ultraviolet light disinfection, and the water is pure water at the end. And water is just too valuable to only use once. So I would say, yes, this is expensive water, but we cannot afford not to have any water at all. Well, flat truckers, there you have it. Straight from the toilet to the tap. Do you think that the rest of America is gonna adopt these laws? Y'all let me know. Let me know in the comment section. Hit me up. Are y'all gonna be drinking the boo boo, poo poo, doo doo, yoo hoo? Well, it ain't really yoo hoo, but you know what I'm saying. Till next time, runaway child, and we are. Ah!